This is day 64 of our daily memory verse challenge. It's the 4th of March 2020. And I'm sharing from Ephesians chapter 5 verses 29 and 30 which says, After all, no one ever hated their body, but they feed and care for their body just as christ does the church for we are members of his body all right so remember this is a continuation of yesterday hmm? they all run along same 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 sentence about husbands loving their wives just as they love their bodies just as their bodies you know why it's still the same analogy that is being made in this the whole in this chapter okay so Christ is the head and the church is the body is one entity hmm? the same way the husband is the head and the wife is what the body you are not different to you are one entity you are together okay however the husband is the head just similarly the way christ is the head and the wife is the body similarly the church is the body of christ so this is not a matter of this is my room this is your room this is your money this is my money this is your car this is my car no we are one together one entity it's just that husband is head wife is body okay narrowing it down to the verse we just read and linking it up with yesterday's own you have husbands as the head ah, on a responsibility too much oh, to be head not be easy it's not by mouth it's by the doing understanding your role as the head and exercising it putting it into action that's the main the main okay so it is your responsibility as the head to do what to feed your body to care for your body so if you know how you take care of your body no human being in their correct mind hates their body if you are if you dislike your body you don't take care of your body you don't bait you, you i just hate this body this is the body i like in fact i want to be be beating this body all the time be beating the body you carry knife stab cut your hand ah what has that turned to? You have turned to a psychiatric case. You need psychiatric evaluation. It's called self-harm. Dangerous. Mm -mm. That, is not, that is not normal sense. Something is wrong upstairs in the head. Is That's when you see people beating their body and, you know, trying to use bot to scratch themselves. Madness psychia straight that's where that kind of head belongs no you pamper your body you shave shave it if the hair there is grown and smelling you shave it you put better deodorant wash it bait yourself for fine cream eh even if you don't have money to buy cream if not vaseline you go rub out you know what make it the white and you spray perfume, wear better clothes. Like this, is my mink now. Nah, this is my mink. Just cover the body. They, they pose, package and wear. Flash, they flash. Women, we we know how to package very well. Even men self now they package. Now so men go they package your wife. They design them. Hmm? Carry better watch, wear ring, everything, jewelry. Take care of your body. If na suya way hungry you eat, chop better suya, eat ngongo, correct, feed your body, make you the robust. Eh? 
they flex that's what god expects from husbands just the way christ cares for the church to the point that christ even died gave up his life and husbands you have to give up sacrifice things for your wife lay your lives down for your wives that is what makes you the head and as the head because you are the one that has the brain you are you are the head that's where the brain is the thinking the thinking faculty you have to align yourself with god so that as you are making decisions you are making the right ones and as you are putting that decision you are bringing it to light it is aligning but if you're if you as the head you are not aligned all right with god because god is your head as the man and hey, if it's not well aligned things will be disjointed there'll be catastrophe in the household because you are not well aligned and sometimes as the head you don't want to be the head you don't want to take the lead you don't want to take responsibility ha. oh my god if we continue this way this video will not end hmm? let me try and make it short but you have to take responsibility you don't doze off and tell the the body to go and uh, walk and bring food to the house and the head will just fall asleep if the body wakes up i mean gets up and is walking and the head is not doing what it's supposed to it will jam into the wall now eh? anyways anyways husbands this verse is for you don't beat your wife if you are beating your wife you are a psychiatric case you are beating your body <laughs> if you are not taking good care of your wife she's naked wearing tata clothes you have the money and you rather spend it outside on some flashy babes out there spend your hard-earned money and your body is falling apart uh, when when last did your wife go for checkup? Mm. Okay. Anyway, I'm talking too much, but husbands, be the head. Take care of the body that God has blessed you with. And there's many more to come. This chapter is remaining very little, and it will finish. Okay. But the point is, let us continue to read our bibles every day meditate on god's word my challenge to you memorize at least one verse every day but most importantly practice what the word of god says be a doer of god's word and i'll see you by the special grace of god on day 64 okay <laughs> all right so uh, wow it's minutes have a good night everyone bye